desperate search is underway in Hamilton tonight. Police and volunteers are searching for an 80 year old Hamilton woman, Shirley Love, who left her home yesterday afternoon and hasn't been seen since. Al Sweeney is at the police command center for the search in the Mount Albion Road area of East Hamilton and joins us live. Good evening, Al. Hi there, Kelly. Well, this search started yesterday after Shirley Love went missing yesterday afternoon. And searchers and volunteers have been coming and going here all day long. The police are throwing massive resources at this search, calling in officers and equipments from a range of units. And the community response has been remarkable, with people showing up here all through the day to volunteer for the search. They've been going through trails in the area along the Red Hill Parkway. There are plenty of forested areas and golf courses around here. Police have been using drones to search from the air, some of them from Mohawk College. And police and volunteers have been going up and down the streets looking for any sign of Shirley or in case she decided to huddle up somewhere in the bitterly cold weather. Now, police released a home security shot of Shirley. It shows her after she left her home yesterday. She's a former darts bus driver, but she suffers from dementia and may not know what to do if she's lost. Now, we spoke today to some of her relatives, the police, and volunteer searchers. We walked up around uh, the street and that, and there were a lot of people out looking for us, flashlights. We were out to about 10 o'clock at night looking, and then this morning we went for a walk through the golf course here and seeing a canine unit out looking in that for her, but uh, yeah, no, no sign yet, so hopefully. This is just such a shock, you know, she's, she's, uh, you know, she's a great person, and it's, you hate to see something like this happen. It's a terrible disease, and yeah. yeah. How, how advanced is she? Like, really? The last couple of weeks, she's been getting really, apparently really bad. Buses were all notified with her picture. There's nothing, we went to places where they used to go. Can, you know, we showed everybody right. nothing. It's funny, eh? She yeah, it's so just pendant. one little lady, like you think somebody would see something when there's so many people involved yeah. and there's nothing. We have provided information on her description that she's wearing a gray jacket, black pants, gray shoes and gloves. I understand the jacket could indicate that she may be dressed for the weather, but that is not at all right uh, or correct. It's, the weather's gotten colder and we expect the weather to be colder tomorrow. Uh, she, what is known to us is that she suffers from dementia. That being said, uh, we're worried that she may be even bunkered down in an, uh, at a backyard residence or anything. So we're asking individuals in the area to please check your, uh, your properties. So the weather makes this search even more urgent. It was frigid last night, extremely cold today, and we've got a storm on the way. Now, just a few minutes ago, a member of Shirley's uh, extended family came over to ask us to stress what Constable Barrage was saying there. This is their hope that if any uh, homeowner around here has a place where Shirley may, may have uh, hunkered down to keep warm, if the, if the homeowners could search that area in case Shirley's not well enough to get up by herself and come out.